Robert, when you scout um, Buffalo, they obviously have a lot of great defensive players, Davius White, but Von Miller's not going to be available week one. Um, do you feel that changes the game plan at all from an offensive standpoint? No, because their their D line is is as deep as anyone. They 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 play hard. They're they're relentless up front, and uh, so they've got they've got plenty of horses in the uh, stable, if you will. But uh, they're they're pretty damn good up front. And yes, Von Miller is a phenomenal football player, but I don't. That's not going to change uh, their ability to get after the passer. As you're putting together this game plan for this week, are there things that you were uh, I've obviously there are things that you were unable to do last year with, because Aaron wasn't there. But do you find that that permeates the whole thing? Like, were you doing things defensively last year to almost protect the offense that you don't have to do anymore? No, um, the the goal the goal on defense is to, to get the ball back for the offense as many times as possible. Um, whether it's takeaway, uh, a punt, whatever it is, but you're just trying to get the ball back to the offense, and and then what the offense does from there is uh, is whatever it does but um but no defensively um it, it it you're the you're always just trying to get the ball back it's the best way i can put it will Brees be on a snap count will dalvin be on snap you know because they haven't done as much or are you going to yeah, try to uh, everything we're, we're going to be uh, uh I, I don't know if i want to call it a snap count but we do, we're gonna, we are going to be smart with them or there's a uh, um you know, we'll we'll continue to evaluate and and build up what what we think uh, Monday needs to be, but uh, but it's not that we're putting a snap count on. It's just there's there are two really good football players. Michael Carter is a really good football player, and just trying to find a way to feature all of them, and along with the receivers and tight ends that we have. So there's there's going to be enough to go around. As a coach, is there I don't know if it's the right word, but relief, a sense of relief for you that after all of this talking, after all of this, this is game week. It's finally game week. <laughs> uh yeah, no. Um, well, that's why we do it, right? To to go play games and uh, to experience the highs and lows. I mean, it's. Uh, I've said it to my wife many times and my kids because you know, and and the lows of lows, they you know, there's a lot of anger in a in a coach's household, and uh, um, I always have to remind them that we're living every day in a four hour span on Sunday. We experience every emotion that you can possibly experience in the human body, and. Uh, so we're, we're lucky. And so being a part of this every year never gets old. And uh, we're blessed in every way imaginable.